This is 1890 Wallingford. Low maintenance front yard, typical of the Sun City communities, uh, homes. Nice entrance. When I first enter the home, the first thing I see on my right is the dining area. Then you have a formal living room, gas fireplace. That there is the primary bedroom. So the primary bedroom's right up front, at the front of the house. So I'm standing in the formal living room, now going into the kitchen and family room. You have one sliding glass door to the backyard. Solid surface countertops with granite in the center island. White appliances. They're not soft clothes. Pearls. Um, a lot of cabinet space, which is really great. Double oven. So this little breakfast bar, you could put some stools up against it. I couldn't figure out how to turn on that dining room light, so I didn't. And through that hallway is the garage, and then back to the dining room on the right side. As you can see here, we've got a little hallway, a little half bath. Interestingly, no mirror. And then again, back to the dining room. So back towards the garage. Let's check out the laundry room. They have a little built-in desk. We have a linen closet or a storage closet. I'm standing in the two-car garage. There's an extension you could potentially store motorcycles or golf carts over here on my left. Ceilings are tall enough for storage racks. You see how much space there is there in a window. So walking back through the kitchen, we're gonna check out the two bedrooms. It's the first bedroom. We do have a two-door closet, some linen storage, bathroom, no bathtub, fiberglass surround, just kind of standard, the older style light fixture, original cabinets, And this is the third bedroom, looking to the backyard. Leaving the two bedrooms, I found the switch. <laughs> I don't know why there isn't one on this side. Maybe, uh, maybe one of these is supposed to be, but I know one of them also operates the outside light. Stepping out of the family room, we have the covered patio. There's no fence between you and your neighbor. Here's one side of the house. It's a good size yard. Not much back here. Some oleanders. I think a sumac tree. So this is the guest bedroom over here with the closed shutters. It's your neighbor's yard. And definitely looks like some older HVAC units. Leaving the formal living room, we're gonna go into the primary bedroom. It does look out into the backyard. Um, so it's not really the front like I thought it was. Your 
master bathroom is in the front and it's carpet all through here, uh, but not in the water closet. Quick look into the closet. It's pretty deep. Looks like there's another secondary closet here. A little shelving closet. A last look at the primary bedroom and we're off to the next house. Check this hallway closet when I first came in. So you do have that right behind the front door.